G'day guys and welcome to the only free V-Bucks tutorial that you are ever going to need that's going to show you how to get as many free V-Bucks as you want in the unbelievably popular game Fortnite Battle Royale. A game that I've only started playing recently but I can't get enough of and one of the coolest things about Battle Royale, Fortnite Battle Royale, and I think you'll all agree with me, is the ability to customize your character with really cool things from the item shop like today we've got the limited edition St. Patrick's Day Sergeant Green Clover and the pot of gold, the leprechaun pot of gold with the rainbow and the clover. It's really cool. And there's some unbelievable stuff that pops up in here from time to time. And people want to buy them, right? People want to buy them. And some people are happy to spend their money. And you can do that in the store here by buying V-Bucks. But some people, like myself, don't really like spending real life money on digital currency. And there, there are some people like kids who maybe don't have the money or don't have a credit card. Or maybe you're just not in the position to shell out for a bunch of V-Bucks. I'm happy to tell you guys that just because you don't want to spend your hard-earned money doesn't mean you still cannot enjoy the, uh, the store, the item shop here, and you still can buy anything in here, provided you follow this tutorial. So what we're going to do first is go through the method that we can do this in Battle Royale. Now, Battle Royale has something called a Battle Pass. Everybody that plays this game is immediately granted with a silver battle pass, which is completely free. Now, this thing right here will grant you, I think it's 100 free V-Bucks every, is it every 18 levels? It's almost every 18 levels. So let's say 15 just to round it off. You get 100. At the end of that, I think you probably make something like maybe 500 at the end of the battle pass, which is pretty cool. But if you've got the gold battle pass, which I have down here, you make 100 V-Bucks every seven ranks or every seven tiers that you go up, you get 100 V-Bucks. And at the end of this thing, you have almost, you have almost a thousand free V-Bucks, which would cost you $10 US. And uh, $10 US is the same price of the Battle Pass. The Battle Pass is 900 V-Bucks. So I'd highly recommend if you've got a little bit of money, invest in the Battle Pass because you'll immediately get all of those free V-Bucks, all of the bonuses, extra skins that you unlock, a whole bunch of cool cosmetic stuff. So that's obviously the first step that I'd recommend going down. That's the most obvious and probably one of the most fun ways to do it because the Battle Pass gives you more incentive of things to actually do in the game. So that's one way to do it. But something that I think a lot of people don't realize is that you can actually earn a lot of V-Bucks over here in the other game mode that's available called Save the World. Now, if you don't have Save the World, this part of the tutorial is not going to be any good for you. You do need to have this, but if you are a founder of the game like me, I bought the game when it first came out and I've been playing PvE quite a lot and I've recently started to get into Battle Royale. There are so many V-Bucks to be earned here in PvE that it is ridiculous. You need to play this, guys, if you've got it, because you are going to be earning so many V-Bucks. I don't know how many you can earn per day, but my buddy Entax said it's something like a thousand a day that you can earn, which is unbelievable. So if we have a look, guys, we can see here that the next quest or the mission that I have to do is going to earn me a hundred, right? That... That's pretty cool. That's 100 V-Bucks just for completing a level here. And uh, and that's not the only way you can get V-Bucks. You can actually come here into the quest section. And here you have a whole range of different things that you can do, right? You've got your main quest, your founder quest, tutorials, events, hero quest, side quest, daily quest, challenges completed. This is where the real meat of the whole thing actually is and where you can earn yourself some sweet, sweet V-Buck action. So if we have a look here, guys, that's the one we have on the main page. That's 100 V-Bucks right there just waiting for us to pick it up and to go throw it in the item store and to have a great time <laughs> doing it. We've also got other quests here. Let's just unravel them all and let's just have a look at what we've got here. So if we come down to the events, we click on that, you get firecracker tickets. Okay, that's for a special event that we've got now. But if we come down here... We've got more special currency, hero quest. There is more V-Bucks in here. Let me just have a... There we go. Okay. So you've got your side quest here. So this is gather 20 pieces of shielded data in successful missions. So for doing this, it's as simple as like 20. And you can grind this out so quickly. So, so quickly, guys. 100 V-Bucks just for that. Your daily quests... And this is cool because you're never going to run out of these every single day. You are going to have new daily quests to complete. Have a look at this. 50 V-Bucks. 50 V-Bucks. 50 V-Bucks. That is 150 a day just from these quests right here. That is crazy, guys. If you, if you, at the end of the week, if you do that, you've got over a thousand. You've got over a thousand V-Bucks a week just from this. You could buy something really cool. You could buy a new skin or a, a harvesting tool. And we come down to challenges here. 50 V-Bucks. 
50 V-Bucks Heroes Air again, and then the completed challenges that I've done, well, goodness me, I don't know how many I've earned here since I started playing, but a lot. I've, I've earned a lot of V-Bucks, and I'm very sad to say that because I bought this game before Battle Royale even existed, I used all of my V-Bucks over here in the loot section to buy upgrade llamas. Oh man, if, look, if, if you're a PvE dude and you like PvE and you don't play Battle Royale, then by all means, spend your points in here. But if you play Battle Royale, please guys, don't make the mistake I did when the game first came out and use all of your, I, I think I probably used thousands of V-Bucks on llamas. And now, I'm not so happy. <laughs> now I'm feeling a bit sad about that, but there's not really much you can do. You know, that's just the way that it is and they're gone and there's no point crying over spilt V-Bucks, but I would highly recommend that you take these V-Bucks and you go and use them out in the uh, out in the item store in Battle Royale. And just to give you a little bit of a sample of how easy this actually is, guys. Look, if we take the daily destroy quest, the uh, the propane tanks and the fire trucks, let's just jump into a game very quickly and let's just have a look at how quickly, uh, how easy it is to gather this stuff. You, you, you'll be blown away, guys. Like, for a little bit of your time per day, you're going to rake in the V-Bucks and you're going to be looking snazzy as... So, we've just dropped into the game right now and have a look at this. Look, look, look. We've got propane tank, propane tank, propane tank, propane tank, propane tank. If we come over to these things, we give them a good couple of whacks. Check this out. We'll get those things right there. We'll come down and we'll grab these ones as well. I can't believe how... <laughs> I can't believe how we've literally dropped into an area that has 10 propane tanks side by side. Just waiting for us to completely smash them and to take that sweet, sweet free V-Buck action. So yeah, obviously it didn't register that because I jumped out of the quest before I actually finished the stage. If you don't complete the stage, you don't register what you've done during that mission. But it is as simple as that, guys. It is so flippin' easy. So uh, look, what are you waiting for, guys? This is your opportunity to rake in those V-Bucks. And look, I know it's a little bit of an expense to maybe get to, to get Save the World or to possibly um, get the battle pass, but if this is a game that you really enjoy, then that initial investment is going to end up resulting in more money than, than you save than you can imagine from all the free V-Bucks that you actually get from this. And look, like I said, some really awesome things come out in this shop every single day. And it's sad when you can't buy any of them. So hopefully this video has helped you guys to figure out how you can get free V-Bucks in Fortnite, Battle Royale, and also in Save the World that you can spend here in the item shop. This is my first Fortnite video that I've ever done. It's the first tutorial that I've ever done. I hope it was of some use to you guys, and I hope it was informative enough to give you all of the tools and the information you need to start becoming a very wealthy V-Buck hoarding Fortnite <laughs> Battle Royale player. So if you liked the video, guys, whack a like. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you thought of it. Let me know if you enjoyed it and if you think I should make more of these kind of videos. And if you're not already subscribed, give the subscribe button a whack as well. And hit the bell so you never miss another video. And I will see you guys very soon for the next one. Thank you for joining me. Go get those V-Bucks and I'll see you later. Bye, guys.